Hello YouTube, welcome to another video. Um, this is the start of Road 96, uh, another game that I picked up from uh, Game Pass. It's uh, a relatively new game, uh, as I believe. Uh, and this is the, the start screen. I've just gone around and uh, changed the, uh, the settings. Uh, and I'm about to begin a new game. I really don't know much about this game apart from... Uh, it's a game about road trip or taking a road trip uh, which is something that i've uh, always wanted to do um but only in america um so let's um, get into it hey there so you're one of us aren't you mind if i ask you a few questions question one when you travel you usually I usually travel with family, nowadays anyway. Well, if that's your idea of fun. <laughs> Kidding. So, next question. When you're traveling, do you follow the itinerary or are you more spontaneous? No, I'm definitely uh, very organized. Good to know. And what about politics? What would you do if you disagreed with our country's government? Reb rebel as much as I can, vote to make changes, consider living abroad. Not much of anything, to be honest, yeah. I don't really care about politics. Oh, one last question. When you watch a movie, you do so to... Have a laugh, feel something, learn and discover. Escape reality, experience fear or solve a mystery. Um, definitely have a laugh feel something not so much learn and discovery not when i'm watching a movie maybe a documentary or something um not much of a horror fan and i'm torn between having a laugh escape reality and solve a mystery probably that uh, escaping reality is probably um, the one that I feel strongly or more strongly than the others but you might also watch a movie to ah okay um, probably solve a no have a laugh <laughs> thanks good to know and I guess you're like the other runaway teens trying to flee Petria it's really dangerous to cross the border you have to be careful with the people you meet on the way. Believe me, don't go fainting on me. But each decision could shape your destiny and Petria's too. Okay, I guess it's time for you to hit the road. I hope you're ready. So we are a runaway team? Is that what she's saying? Um, yeah, so one thing I did hear about this game is that each road trip is unique. It's somehow generated by the uh, the computer i mean i'm guessing there is a a limited possibilities um but i'm guessing there are many many of them i'm here at our nation's border under national mountain the site of the black brigade terrorist attack in 86 if you don't remember Hundreds died that day when a brigade truck carrying explosive devices crashed into the mountain, triggering its peak to collapse. In two months, on the same day as the nation's election, in the same spot where I'm standing, the 10-year commemoration honoring the victims... Stand and Give us all your darn money, bitch! You! Yeah. Oh, <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Two here, on my way, over. President Tyrak, the man who built the border wall behind me, protecting our nation, will be there. Protecting our nation? Ha! Huh. This event promises to be a solemn moment, and a time to celebrate the announcement of our next president. Ugh, total BS. Of course, I'll be there live, giving you the real story as it unfolds. This has been GNN Sonia Sanchez reporting live. So, 
Right, we're going to the border. Is that what um, it's saying? I'm guessing we're heading towards that yellow marker to the north. And we've got 1,924 miles uh, to the border. Um, I'm guessing this is like a, a made-up country. So I don't really recognise the map. Not that I'm uh, an expert on maps. Right, so this is 1996. Right, and it says here we've got three dollars. Hold shift to run. I don't really notice much of a if Sonia wants to party, difference. Sonia parties. Jesus, the third person? Look, all Adam's saying is you shouldn't go in. This weirdo could be here. Sonia Sanchez. Who is Sonia Sanchez? This is a party for important people only, sweet pea. Which is why Adam can't go in. Oh, she burned you there. Now, I'm going in. Do I really want to go in? I guess so. Oh, and the kid is coming with me. What? Oh, cool. Sorry, Adam. She's my girlfriend. Come on, kid. Well, that's uh, lucky. Uh uh, Brosif. Like Sonia said, you gotta be famous. Kid, keep an eye on her for me. There's a psycho after her. Well, not much I can do about it. I'm a kid, apparently. Let's have a look, uh, or let's ask her about this psycho. Maybe there is, but you can't live your life in fear. Ah, that's a motto of mine. So we're at some outdoors caravan party, is that what it is? Um, uh, you sound different, why? Why do I, why would I know about how she sounds? I'm gonna go with the top option. You can learn a lot by talking to me. Shoot. Uh, know anything about cops and row ninety six? Do you do stories on teens crossing? Any tips for surviving on the road? I think that might be relevant to our uh, our purpose. The more money you got, the better. Sometimes I withdraw money from my account just to hold it. Hang on, why am I looking at her from behind? <laughs> uh, let's talk to her here. Right. Money should be shared. No, we need to rob the rich. Money helps you do what you want. Uh, yes. But I feel like maybe if I choose the first option, she might give me some. Oh? Sorry you feel that way. Now go on and enjoy yourself, sugar. <laughs> this isn't a date. That's adorable. So apparently asking her for money has had an impact on uh, on my story this time round. Uh, we'll, just, we'll just walk around, I suppose. It's a bit weird how uh, things have turned out. We were supposed to go on a road trip, but somehow we've ended up in a uh, some sort of party that, that I don't really want to be at. What is this? Never... Oh, this is... Is this uh, some sort of... What? It says tickets. Oh, right. So, scratch card. So, you pay to basically get yourself a scratch card, which I don't have enough money for. I'm a dollar short. I wonder if I can find some money, like, just lying around. What's this place? Who wanna play a game? Oh, so you gotta kick the football to knock the cans off. Eight dollars. Uh I don't have enough money. Yeah, you don't look like a winner anyway. <laughs> I certainly don't look like a loser. What's over here? Play, don't wanna play that.
This is a strange party, definitely. What do you mean? Who are all these people? They're all big donors to Tyrak's campaign. He's throwing a big party for all of them ahead of his next election. Tyrak, what a great guy. Oh, can I not ask about tips for the road? So I don't have any, well, I don't have money for this, um, this store. Is that a cash machine? Yep, which I don't have a card for. So I've come out on the road, running away to the borders with $3. I hope I don't have to, like, keep feeding myself or, you know, drinking water to survive. Don't see anything I can interact with here. Oh, there's a little arcade place. Does he want to play me? I'll play. I won. Well, I didn't win. I scored. Do I get money if I uh, win? Is there a prize? This is quite realistic, actually. Oh, I've got a voter badge. Someone in the party is willing to exchange them. Okay. What's going on here? One dollar to pay and take. Oh, what's this? Oh, yes, I found some loose change. Which means I'm going to have a go on this, whatever this is. Oh, that's the game that the boy was playing. Which is basically like air hockey, right? I guess I've got to get three to win. Oh! Damn it. That just sped up all sped up all the all of a sudden. Yes, got one back. speeding up oh no I'm gonna lose you know. oh yes right sudden death Pulled it out of the bag. Got another badge. Okay. Right, that's enough of that. Oh, I don't want to play anymore. Uh, what's on the floor? Not a lot. The controls are a bit weird. My mouse is very insensitive, but my uh, keyboard is very sensitive. Let me just sort it out. It is a little bit better. Not great. Oh, I'm guessing that's... Uh, the VIP section, is it? Let's speak to the doorman. Sorry, kid. This is private. Yeah, and I'm the Minister of Oil. Oh, he doesn't believe me. I bet I can uh, sneak in somehow. Right, what else do we have? Can we go in there? You got levers under the table. I know you do. Hi, kid. Perhaps you'd like to play. Girlfriend, nice to see you. Uh, I'll play. This round is free, young lady. Okay. <laughs> Good, because I've got no money anyway. Ready? Here we go. Uh, left. And you win. See? It's simple. You shuffled faster for me. Another try, young lady? Oh, 
And you can place a bet too. Uh, yeah, go on in. Excellent. If you win, you get double. A wise bet. You don't take your eyes off the cup. Ready? I bet he's gonna go, go fast now, isn't he? Excellent pick, young lady. Excellent pick, young lady. Another round? I'm gonna get in on this. Put a little bet down of my own. The lady has spoken. I shut the hell up. Shoot. Left my wallet near the can. Get it for me, Lamb Chow. Near the can. What does that even mean? She left her wallet near the by the can. Oh, the toilets. Where is the toilet? I guess we can just keep on exp Oh, there's the toilet. What's this flashing? Hmm, don't know. Fake lights, is it? Uh, right, there's the toilet. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's a wallet. Oh! Is that the psycho? Probably is. Is there anything else in here? No. I'm guessing I should report back to her about this uh, psycho. Did he have a gun? I couldn't see properly. What guy? So, like I said, I'm going to put more dough down on the key. She doesn't care. Ready? Here we go. I've not put a bet on yet. Right. You win. Oh wow. Got thirty dollars. That's brilliant. I'm gonna put down some more. Jelly bean here is a goddamn winner. I know it. Yes, a real winner. Look who's starting to sweat, sweet cheeks. Clown face here. Ready? Here go we on go. In. Oh, this is ridiculous. You, oh, but I got win. it though. <laughs> Fifty dollars. Nice. Uh oh. Looks like Gumdrop has your number. Let me put down even more. No. Shut up and play. Ready? Oh Here no. We go. I can't escape. Boom. Oh, come oh, on. Three out of three. That's impossible. Just give me a second. I'll, I'll be right back. Get yourself some more scratch and get back here. We ain't done yet. Oh, Jesus. Not again. Worry about taking a shower. I'm fine. I think she needs to leave. You're starting to sound like Adam Snookums. You know what? Get me a drink from the tent. Get one for yourself, too. You need to chill. Oh, honey, I know jujitsu. You see these hands? They can tear a man in two. Now get us some drinks! Now! <laughs> Why is she always screaming? What a bitch. Right, got $166. I might be able to get myself uh, a burger and uh, some scratch cards. What's this dude doing? He's just out of it, isn't he? Uh, right, so she said go and get some drinks. Oh, there's a the creepy guy again. There he is, there he is. Oh, he's gone. Is he outside? I mean, I suppose it doesn't take much effort if he wants to uh, hop over the fence and come in. Hey, you're with Sonia, right? I am. Well, um, some weird guy in a hat was just talking about her. I know. What did he say? I'm not sure. There was a lot of, um, grunting, but he didn't like her. I know that much. 
Right, I can ask for tips for the road now. That I don't think teens should be on the road? No, not really. Oh, is that it? So not really uh, tips then. Right, since this is the only drink that I can buy, I will take it. You know what? I've got money to burn. I want to take the burgers as well. I'm sure uh, it will come in handy at some point. And where is that scratch card? Oh, the scratch card's over there. Uh, I can play kick the football, kick the can. Let's have a go and see how hard it is. You play a game? If you win three Tyrek badges, you get a prize. I see you already have some badges. Colour me impressed. The other games and the arcade. Good luck. So can I play or not? Oh, right, I'll go. Go into here. Okay, what am I doing? Is that it? Just kick? Do I need to close the door first? I mean, what if the ball flies out? Okay. Uh, <laughs> is it random? I want to line myself up. Oh, that's rubbish. What the hell? There's no power meter. It's just kick and that's it. Oh, left the bloody arena. Right, okay. I guess... Uh, it's about taking part. I've got three badges now. Oh, another badge. And remember to vote for Tarek. Vote for continuity. Oh, I feel like that's uh That was a bit of a rip-off, really. Can I kick some more? I'll get more badges if I knock the rest of the cans over probably not okay anyway let's just go I think Sonia is uh, getting thirsty I'll take a couple of these cards uh, get scratch ticket why can I not get a scratch oh I don't have any ID is that what that means uh, I'll take a lucky star. I lost. I'll take one of these. I won. What did I win? One dollar. Uh, no. You know what? I've got 135. Should probably keep it. Who's this? Call 96112 if you have information regarding the Brigade radio transmitter. $1,000 reward. What does that even mean? Don't know. See people dancing over there. Oh, hello. Where's the bar? Are the games, are the games to play? Where are the toilets? What kind of party Tyrek is this? Loves to throw parties for his biggest donors. You must be the daughter of someone important. Uh, no, I'm not, sir. But thank you for assuming you want, that I am. Are you talking to me? No? Uh, where's Sonia again? She was past this queue, and then, oh yeah, she's... Oh dear, she's gone. Dum, dum, dum! I don't know, kid. I thought she was with you. I really hope something bad didn't happen to her. Yep, I think you're just uh, angry still because uh, you lost all the money. I knew that was going to happen. Get a drink, come back, she'll be gone. Sonia? What's going on there? Oh, that's me screaming Sonia. As if. Nobody cares. Sorry, I have not. But what a wonderful journalist she is. Tyrak's favourite, you know. Hmm... 
Right, there's one more place that we haven't been to, and that is... Uh, oh, I thought there was dancing people about. Or did I just make that up in my head? Oh, yeah, it was over there, but uh, I can't get into it. What about now, though? Can I go in? No. So she hasn't come this way. So she has disappeared. So I've just got to keep calling out for her. Let's have a look over by the toilets. There's a set of stairs there. Is that the one that I came down from? Alright, she's not dead in there. Creepy guy's not there. Let's go up here. Alright, that's the entrance. Maybe she's left? No, she can't have, because Adam's still there. Talk to the driver, kid. Okay. Whoa! Calm down, kid. She's in the limo. Oh, right, okay. Uh, her stalker is here. Take it easy there. Personally, I'm not into violence. Uh, okay. Besides, we'll never get him or her now. Too many people here. But thanks for looking after her. I know she's Sonia, but she's a good person underneath. Uh, I'm sure she is. See you around, okay? And thanks again. Is she really in the limo, though? I mean, you know, I didn't see her. And it's one of those uh, rules in movies, isn't it? If you haven't seen a dead body, then that character is probably not dead. Right, so what are the options? So there's a bus station. I can put my thumb up to hitch a hike. Uh, driving? I can steal a car? Is that what you're saying? Well, I don't have the keys anyway. Ring for a taxi. Or speak to these... Oh, can I not cross the road? Oh, I want to speak to those uh, strange people over there. Or oh, I can walk. Am I even heading in the right direction, though? How do I know it's not over there? Oh, mind you, if it's saying walk this way, I'm guessing I'm meant to be uh, heading in this direction. Leave and walk along the road. Let's see what happens. Right, so there are meant to be seven people that we are supposed to meet. So you can get to meet the same person more than once, because it says here, Sonya, 14%. I wonder if this is just this gameplay or whether it's, um, you know, carry across the whole, you know, like different playthrough. My meter has gone down. I don't know what that means. Is that my energy? Nobody's supposed to be here. What is this about? What's uh, happened to my burger? And where am I? This is all looking a bit barren. Can't jump. Maybe I'll find a dead body uh, in the... Oh, no. I was going to say, I thought oh, <laughs> there might be something to discover in the, uh, in the sand, but no, I can't go over there. Just a rusty car. What's this? Missing teens. Five, 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 five. Immediately. Can't really see the names, and there is certainly no pictures. Oh, wrong way. Down there.
this is where a lone teen like me is going to get killed. Can I pick up that stick? No. Oh, hello. What's this? Creepy derelict building. Fishing rod. I wonder if there's anything on the end of that. Um, okay, I found myself a tape. Let's have a look at these uh, caravans. No, can't go in. Doesn't look like there's anything inside that I can pick up. Nothing in the skip. Looks like either this building was being built and then somebody just gave up or it's in the middle of being taken down. Can't really make out what's on the other side of this door. Loss of graffiti. What I want to know is, is what the um, story is behind our... Uh, oh, money. $20 just left lying around. Um, yeah, what is the story behind our character? I mean, why are we, you know, on this road trip? Why are we going to the border? You know where our you know where are our parents or family siblings whatever is it getting dark or is this like the morning right okay so that is my uh, energy bar top left i have to keep eating and drinking i guess oh hello what is this well maybe we don't have to wear the outfits all the time crazy talk mitch now, shh, it's almost time for the Sonia show. I wonder what she's going to wear today. <laughs> Me too. That pink number, maybe. Am I supposed to go in there? I, yeah, possibly. I can see a dirt bike of some sort. Not a dirt bike, like a, a motorbike of some sort. I'm guessing I'm supposed to go over to it. Am I going to get spotted? I'll probably fall down. You hear that? Yep, I knew it. Ugh. That's not the creep after Sonya, is it? Nope. Kid ain't nothing but a hitchhiker. Tie her up. Oh no. Told you she wasn't dead. You were right. Guess I owe you five big ones. I don't have it on me right now. But I will as soon as we rob the kid. Oh, Stan and Mitch. I'm supposed to meet these people. Let's have a quick look around. There's the map of um, this country, whatever this country is. Lots of money over there. TV is on. They've got a generator. Okay. Let me go. <laughs> Big talk for a little lady tied to our kitchen chair. Give us all your money. Do that, and you'll walk out of here with just a few broken bones. Yeah, yeah, all your money. Damn it. No, I'm gonna lie and say I don't have any. Ooh, looks like we got a tough kid on our hands, Mitch. Maybe I'll have to show her the beast. Whoa, you hear that? The beast. Now search her, Mitch. Damn it, they're going to nick all my money. Stan, we done did find the goose who laid the golden egg. Kid's loaded. No, the kid was loaded. See the difference? Nice I'm not happy one, about Stan. this. Thanks. 
Mitch, this kid is starting to hurt my ears. Show her the beast. With pleasure. <laughs> now come on, we got work to do on our investigation. Sweet Sonia's life hangs in a balance. So it sounds like these people are trying to like help Sonia. Crazy, Mitch. Yeah, me too. And if we don't crack this soon, it'll be too late. What are you talking about? Quiet, little lady. Do I have to show you the beast again? Yeah, shut your trap. Let the grown-ups think in peace. Kid, someone wants to end Sonia's life. The famous reporter? Yeah, we doubt that you could help us. <laughs> well, I can because I've seen the guy. I've been on the road and know things. I've actually met her. I could help. They won't believe me if I tell them I've met her. Stan, remember what we read in the Goss Mag? Oh, yeah. She had a kid in her limo. Pick her up. We'll make you a deal, kid. Help us, and you'll get your money back. Uh, plus more, because she just kicked me in the face. Uh, what choice do I have? Sounds fair, I guess. So we're trying to find out when the killer is going to attack. We got some of his letters and things right here. When he's going to attack is somewhere in them. We just know it is. Uh, okay, so show me. Oh, I'm free now. Um, what letters? Enter date. Oh, right, so I've got to look at the letter, enter the date, and look at all these bits of letters, and enter the date to tell these two when it's going to happen. Okay. He says he's going to act oh. on his kid's birthday. Sleep is no longer an option. I spend my nights at the office planning, planning, and planning some more. I know now I'll act on Lola's birthday. Yes, Sonia Sanchez and the brigades will pay for what they've done. You can bet on it. Son, uh, sorry, Lola's birthday. He had this letter in his journal. I guess his daughter was fond of reptilians. Mr. Winter says not to contact anyone, but I feel I should tell you we're leaving tomorrow morning to do something in four days that will change everything. One day you will understand why I joined the brigade's promise with all my love. Right. That guy's seriously disturbed, Stan. The days go on one day indistinguishable from the next, then a moment of clarity. I've changed my mind one last time. I know when I'll act. I just don't know where. If anything happens to sweet Sonia, I might just go crazy. Dear Lola, today you would have been... 23 years old they say time heals wounds but for me it seems to open them up again still i've decided your birthday shouldn't be a day of death even if they deserve it today will always be the day my baby girl was born and nothing else that leaves just one day for my revenge the day 10 years ago when you said everything would change it did change, but not in the way you meant your father. Right, is that all the letters? Look at. Happy eight years, Lola. So, uh... Today marks the anniversary of Lola's death. In exactly two years, I will take my revenge. Do we know when that was recorded, Stan? Yeah, sometime in 1994. So I'm guessing Lola is dead. It was written in... doesn't really matter what year it's written in. Because the guys wants to know what date and what month is going to happen. Um, there's something about four days, is it? 
So we're leaving tomorrow, which means it will be the 6th of December. Uh, sorry, September. Uh, tomorrow morning to do something in four days that will change everything. So that will make it the 10th, right? So tomorrow morning to do something in four days. So, yeah, so in five days, basically, she's going to do something that will change everything. And it says here, so... Uh, oh, hang on, is this the one? Yeah, so the day... The day ten years ago, when you said some everything would change... So her birthday is September 10th, I'm guessing. But how do I figure out, well, I can't figure out where or who. Let's try that. I don't think that's it, kid. Yeah, that don't look right. Try again. Try again. Oh, that's it! It all makes sense now! You're a genius! Okay. Deepest apologies I showed you the beast earlier. I don't know what I was thinking. We still need to figure out what this guy looks like. And where the attack is gonna happen. But, uh, you know, now we're making progress. Yeah, we are. Here's your cash, kid. It's best to honor one's promises. Stan and Mitch rules. Okay. Uh, how do I leave? The ladder near the TV. Just climb it. Now get. Okay. Nothing else to pick up, is there? But, uh, before you go, maybe you want to ask us something? Uh, survival tips for the road. Steal as much as you can. Yeah, we do that a lot. <laughs> um, yeah, I can steal, no problem. You could steal for the brigade. Maybe you won't if Floris wins. Um, I don't know what that means. I mean, I'm guessing this is one of these uh, questions that will have an impact on the game. Uh, I'm going to go with the uh, less criminal option. Nah, I'm pretty sure we'd still steal. Yeah. Okay then. Thank you. Not thank you. How do I get out? Where's the ladder? Is that the ladder? Ah, okay, so those guys are supposed to be uh, good people. What's this? Oh, give me some money. Damn it. Right, I take it this is not a bike that I can uh, use. I will go back onto the road then. Stand in those weirdos. Rest. Uh, I think I'm okay. So I can call a taxi, hitchhike, or wait for the bus. Think I've yeah, I've definitely seen this. Pay for the bus. Why pay for the bus when I can hitchhike and expose myself to danger where did that sign come from
Right, so I've met Stan and Mitch. Who am I going to meet next? Oh, it's raining. Blame it on the rain. Some truckers picked me up. Rain won't quit, will it, young blood? You've met John. Hello, John. Don't fall asleep with the wheel. Been sleeping well lately. Whoa. Hey now. No one touches my radio but me. Yeah. A lot of long nights on the road. Well, that's the life I signed up for. A fly promoting Senator Flores in the upcoming presidential election on September the 9th. So that's the same day that the psycho is going to do something to uh, Sonia. Can I open that? Is she going to get mad? Found my tapes, huh? Each, Each one comes with a ton of memories. Took one, did you? Well, just take care of it, all right? I have no legs. Oh, what a nice man. He's uh, giving me uh, his tape. What's with all the labels? Right, uh, will you be okay? Be lying if I said no. Well, let's talk about something else. You start, okay? Is it safe to sleep under the stars? Best way to get energy high on the road. Advise on how to cross the border. Mm, well, it's dangerous. That's for sure. That's why people need to vote. If I cross, I can help others. I have to get out of this country. I don't know why I'm going. Um, I see. Oh well, get to the border. Then pick a lock. Get in one of the trucks at the gate. Then don't make a sound. That part's very important. Okay. Pick a lock. Get into the back of a truck. Sneak our way in. Right, don't fall asleep, please. Oh my god, don't fall asleep. Do I play something? Let's play something. So he doesn't fall asleep. Hey, hey now. Uh, please stay awake. This old lion's tired. Uh, I think you should pull over. Not necessary. Starting to feel better already. Yes, sir. And I know some breathing exercises to activate 99% of the mind. I'll just do some of those and... He's missing some fingers. You seen this? Good to go. But you should rest. Need your energy on the road. Go on, young cub. Ain't got all my fingers, but you're in good hands. Uh, really? Okay. I guess. I don't have any other option. Luckily, I picked up his tape and uh, played it in there. You guys didn't hear it because I've had to uh, turn off all the music just in case it's uh, copyright music. Oh my god, he's asleep again. Oh, hello, what's this? Emergency brake? No, let's pinch him. Come on, John, wake up. How's the truck still going like in a straight line? Uh, I'm going to have to pull the brakes and I... Yeah, please get some sleep. I should, yeah. But uh, you got to get this cargo somewhere fast. What's the cargo? Uh, John? Uh, adult diapers. No, it's not. Yeah, don't make fun of me. Oh, just up the road. Yeah, only one solution. 
You gotta make me an omen vitality. A what? Get in the back. I'll explain. I'll get in the back and then you'll bloody uh, fall asleep again. Sorry about the mess. I'm not the cleanest ombre. Yeah. All right, let's uh, steal some food because we need that. Steal some money. Ask thirty percent. I don't want to steal his money. Uh, look at the photo. His wife, girlfriend. That's kind of young blood. Beautiful, isn't she? Mind putting that back? That's a real valuable object. Pains me to say this. But Connie's no longer with us. Oh. She passed away ten years ago, when the peak collapsed. Mm, that's how I lost these fingers, trying to get to her under the fallen rocks. But the truth is, I'd have given my whole arm, my whole life, to save her. She was the wind in my sails. And I'll miss her for the rest of my days. Right, what else is there? There's the now Omen really Vitality. Ginseng, cucumber and coffee beans. Put them all together, shake hard and fast. Hard for my big J to, to keep darkness. you awake on those long nights, your darling Connie. Okay, ginseng, cucumber and coffee beans. Do I have any? What's in here? Oh, it's a music box. What's this? No idea. Uh, more pictures? Probably Connie and John. Most ingredients should be in the fridge. Uh, oh, there's the ginseng. Yep. Anything else? In the fridge. Cucumber should be up top. Yeah. Oh, is this some sort of puzzle? <laughs> oh, come here. Thank you. Check for the beans at the bottom. Oh God. Move the ingredients around so you can grab them. First time. All right, shakers here. Hell yeah! Good too. Woo! <laughs> hey, my drink almost ready. Vitality! Go on, sip, young blood. That'll knock your socks off. Uh oh, I've got extra two blocks on my energy bar. I guess that is awesome. It is, but it's the awfulness that keeps you awake. Keep the oh. recipe. <laughs> It'll come in handy. Did I press uh I think I misread that. It wasn't awesome. It was awful. <laughs> ability acquired. Omen Vitality. The ability adds two additional bars to your total energy capacity. Now, time to put the pedal to the metal. Welcome to ride with me further if you want. Your choice. Uh, I think I'll get out. Actually, no, I'm not getting out now. I mean, look at this place. It's raining. Okay then. Here we go. Wow, that uh, went down quite fast. So we've met John now as well. Let's see what happens next. Thanks, John. See you next time. But why has he dumped me off here in the middle of nowhere when he's, like, continuing on? It's the, it's the middle of the night. Smells like teen spirit. Love that song. Welcome to the Night Skies Campground. 
more of the uh, same posters that we've seen missing teens and uh, reward for radio transmitter which I don't think I've seen any um, I'm guessing we have to uh, go inside got some money should be able to pay for a night's rest right you're gonna vote right uh totally oh okay good you know that's another reason Tyrax sends you teens you know where so that your vote can't be heard oh really I want to ask about your cat that's Mr. Bottles don't be fooled dude is a wild man can I pet your cat? Okay, got an achievement for petting the cat. Is that the end of the dialogue for you? I'm guessing so. What's on the table? More flyers? Um, what did that say? Reception. And then... Oh, right, okay, so these are all rooms. Get your tapes and snacks here. Tapes and snacks. I don't think... Oh, I'm going to get a tape. Because these seem to be like collectibles in this game. Don't need any food. I'm good for energy. And it doesn't seem like I can carry my food with me. Um, Because I had a burger and a drink, didn't I? From, the, um, from that party. And then they disappeared. I'm guessing... My inventory just disappears when I move on to the next area. I am. Well, that's why I'm selling this stuff. Well, it's expensive to be a runaway teen. Okay, well, you can continue to be poor because I'm not buying that for ten dollars. Look, just give me the money and I won't call the cops. A guy got stabbed here two days ago, and they never came. The cops aren't going to show for this. Oh, that's the girl from the um, start of the game, right? I don't have time for this. Just admit you stole from me, and... I didn't do it. <sighs> You've met Zoe. What's going on here, then? She stole money from my office, then tried to pay her rent with it. I don't need your money, man. Do you have proof? Who are you? Her attorney? No, I don't have proof. She turned off my security camera. She's a criminal mastermind. <laughs> your case is weak. You teens. I don't need the hassle. I'm out of here. <sighs> yep, go away. I didn't have to do that, you know. I was handling it. All right, all right, all right. I just saved you, did I not? Uh, didn't seem like it. Well, I was, okay? Anyway, welcome to the Night Skies Campground. If you like crappy trailers, this place is the best. Why are you up there? To look at the stars? I know, I know, it's cheesy. Uh... I'm going to see if there's a free option. Always good to have money and save my money and don't spend any money unless I have to. There's some cardboard around here. And you're dancing Carl. He's like this guy who's really competitive about dancing. You'll know when you meet him. Yeah, see you around, I guess. Hey, don't become roadkill out there, okay? No. I won't, because the game won't uh, let me cross the road anyway. Anything here on the table that I can pinch, like this. Hey, I won five dollars. That's good. Maybe I will get a trailer after all. And go and meet the owner. Who are you? Hey, you got any money? Uh, yes. Nice, nice. Can I have some? Go on then. You're real nice. And that's why the road is gonna eat you alive. No. Oh, what a bitch. Eat rotting food. No, I'm not gonna eat rotting food. Uh 
Uh, okay. Seen that. So I guess if I do see a radio transmitter, I can call it in and get myself a thousand dollars. This is 191.9, the voice of the brigades. This is your papa baby here. With the upcoming fraud of an election, more and more countries are calling for the resignation of tyrant. I mean, Tyrak. But will he step down? Of course not. Which is why, dear listeners, we must resist this man and his government as much as we can. And now, here's a tune from a fresh new band. Remember, Papa Baby loves you. You left the radio outside, Denny. Turn it off before you get us arrested. Who is talking to me? Or are they talking to me? I'm guessing they're not talking to me. Uh, more posters about radio transmitter. Um, where's Dancing Kyle? Ah, oh, there he is. Feel free to join if you can hang. Go on then. No one can really dance with me. I'm on another level. But knock yourself out. See what I mean about not being able to dance with me? <laughs> okay. Uh, something has happened to my character. It was flashing. Um, where can I sleep for free? There's some cardboard right there beside that guy, but he's a snorer. Uh, that guy? What? I can't hear you over the music! I don't need to scream! Go talk to the owner! In his office! Okay. No one in? Let's go and uh, speak to this dude. The, there's some cardboard right there. But I gotta warn you, I'm a snorer. Okay. I don't want to. I can ask him for some money, though. Uh, I, I don't usually give money to journeying teens. But you seem... What's the word? Pathetic. <laughs> okay. Well, I got my three dollars back from uh, balancing out to the three that I gave to this guy here. Well, I guess I have to find lost. somewhere to sleep. <laughs> if you want to run a trailer, go up the stairs to my right and talk to the owner. Otherwise, find the dancing guy. There's cardboard near him. I'm going to go to um, speak to the owner, find out what this theft is about. But before I do... Oh, okay. I can get some stuff. Maybe I'll get some stuff in the morning when I wake up. Nothing around here. I guess this is his trailer, is it? Probably. Right, how much? What do you want? I got trailers here. Trailers you can sleep in. If you got the dough. 2550 ring the bell <laughs> I'm right here what does that say 4166 I wonder if this uh, I wonder what that is 4166 that's got to be a clue to something right maybe there's a lock somewhere that I can use that pin code to open I didn't see anything locked though. Or oh, is that? Hmm, I don't know. I'm, I've, got, I've got a feeling that hint that 4166 is a clue to something. Maybe I can like break into his office or something. 
vandalize. <laughs> okay. I don't know why I wanted to do that, but hey. I wonder if she lost. knows. <laughs> if you want to run a trailer, no, I don't want to run a trailer. And talk to I want to find some owner. secrets. Otherwise, find the dancing. Oh, this is the one. Yes, must be. Four, one, six, six. Yes. Quick, close the door. What's in here? Not a lot. There's nothing in here. Forty-five dollars. Is that it? I knew that pin number went to uh, somewhere. I don't want to vandalise more of her posters. You don't know where you're going, do you? <laughs> if you want to I know where I'm going. Go the to my right. Now that I've uh, stolen this man's money, I'm going to pay him and get myself a big trailer. I got trailers here, trailers you can sleep in. If you got the dough, let me show you to your spacious trailer. I bet that's the owner. Hey, 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 wake up. Oh. Come hang out with me. For God's sake, woman, it's the middle of the night. I just pay for this trader. Up here. Why are you, like, waking me up? Where are we? Are we outside Hurry the trailer up. park? Oh, God. Is this Come her here. trailer? Sit with me. You don't have any marshmallows, do you? Sorry, I ask everyone that. Anyway, it's nice to have someone normal around here. Is she another runaway as well? I left home at the start of the summer. I wanted to get out of Petria. Like you, I think. My dad thinks I'm on a big road trip. Truth is, I'm never going back home again. Uh, why did you want to leave? To have a normal life? My dad says I'm lucky because I have a privileged life here. But that life disgusts me. Especially now that I know... Uh, know what? Uh, never mind. I... I don't know. Only about 1% of us do. Or so I hear. And you know what happens to the rest. The pits. Or worse the what what is going on where they send kids they think are gonna cross Terrible oh right things happen there and i really hope i never experience them for myself uh yeah me too well enough about all that hey why don't we play a little music <laughs> really Let's play Bella Chow. I used to play this all the time. You know. Come on, don't be scared. Give it a shot. <laughs> this is difficult. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> okay, now let's try it with the music. 
Uh, what? I should be recording this. <laughs> This is really hard. Okay, faster. <laughs> My stomach hurts. <laughs> oh my god, what's going on? Everything's gone black. Is she okay. drugging me or something? serious i got you kicked out nah, don't sweat it i was gonna leave anyway but i'm just sorry for you well i was gonna leave too oh so we can ask her to hit the road together that's sweet but i think i need to travel on my own it's important to me you know uh okay thanks for understanding well we should probably start packing huh good luck out there Oh, uh, this is for you. To remember this moment. Right. Thank you. Uh. Oh, okay. So I've just got to leave now, am I? But did he not just say it was three in the morning? Am I really going to get a taxi or wait for a bus at three in the morning? Um. But anyway, I'm going to call it a day here uh end this part uh, and we'll pick this up in the next part um and just remember this is one of those games that each player are supposed to get a unique um gameplay uh and a unique ending i'm guessing uh so do come back subscribe to the channel ring the uh, bell and you'll be notified when i upload the next part uh and until then thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one